It's me again, Chris Blackdoor Harris. Boy, it's been crazy to know that every time you watching something, a TV, smart TV that is. Every time you watching something, you don't know what you're gonna get. For instance, like saying you're watching Pokemon, you know what's gonna happen. Well. Before we get started on this subject for today's episode of Chris Pokemon Talk, I want you to hit that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment below and tell me what you think. Alright, you ready? Boy, 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 how can I put it to you guys? It's like it's crazy to know. This season of Pokemon when it comes to Pokemon We don't know what we're going to expect. But, I think, I think this season, the Japanese season, Pokemon has a theme to it. You know, first in the beginning, there was re battles. Just last Sunday was Gigantamax. Now today, it's all about catching without battling. And that's saying something, people. You're wondering, what is that saying? Well, I'm telling you this now. Pokemon Sword and Shield, the Gallery Region Saga, it's about to get funky, baby. Real funky. And I mean, not just any type of funky. I'm talking about funky, baby. Why? Like I said, raid battles. Gigantamax. Uh, now, we, we just watch, I just watch Gal. You know, throw pokeballs around all willy nilly. After he caught Score Bunny, I'm wondering how this is gonna work. Hmm. Really, but I'm not lie. I'm not gonna lie. It's crazy to know that when it comes down to it, Pokemon. And not just a series. It's something that we got to learn from. It's like. A comparison to the game. And to the series. Like say. Hmm. I'm trying to put it in a way y'all can understand me. And that is... Okay, okay. This how it's going to work. Like I said, this morning I watched the episode 6. Entitled... Catching Pokemon Road to Mew. To Mew. That means... Got... Go... Was catching Pokemon left and right. Without battling. 
So it got me thinking. Okay, are they doing a Pokemon Go thing here? No. Because they were doing a Pokemon Go thing. Go. Go will have been tossing berries while trying to catch them. You know. But for, from my point of view. This is more like a let's go theme. That's right, everybody. I said let's go. As in, every time Go went to a Pokemon, what he did was just toss Pokeballs like crazy. I mean, it was crazy. It had me excited how this boy was doing. He caught two Pokemon for the price of one. A Paris and a Parasac. He caught all three evolutions of Caterpie, Metapod, and Butterfree. All three. Of his evolutions of Caterpie. And I was crazy. I'm just going to lie. Then Weedle at the same time too. I mean. What happened was. He caught Weedle in a tree. He caught Kakuna in a tree as well. But it failed. Then. When the bee drill was chasing Ash and Go. Ash used the electric web. While he just caught one bee drill with one swing. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. And so what surprises me is this. Oh boy, it is, it is crazy people, I don't lie. He called himself a pincer while Ash had to battle it. It's a shame, really it was, it was. I thought Ash was going to catch that Pokemon for, for a second there. But what happened was, Gal, Gal caught it. I mean, it took a guy out of the half a minute just to catch a Cypher. And I was surprised. I mean, it was kind of really, really weird. How Sada used Slash, Air Cutter, and Agility. Hmm. Slash, Air Cutter, and Agility. Well, that's a perfect Pokemon for Go. Man, I can't believe Gao was. Gao was that. Gao had become a G when he came to Pokemon. I ain't gonna lie. He become a G. A true G of Pokemon. I mean, it's crazy how it sounds while I'm saying this, but it got me excited this morning. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all can look at me all you want and say he's crazy, he's nuts, and he needs Jesus. But trust me, I know what I'm talking about. Go has... I'm not Go. Gal has caught bug Pokemon left and right. He caught a Venomoth with just one toss. It took him a while just to catch a Venomat. I thought he would catch a Diglett right then and there. I thought he was going to catch the drill as soon as the drill tossed him up for the last third time. And I mean, that count was at one, two, whoops. Boom! You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie, people. I ain't going to lie. It's like... It's like the wrestler, the lucha wrestler, put the gun in jail. See? Eros. You know that means zero fear, people. Zero fear. Zero mother... Because trust me, the next Pokemon game they gotta do is Let's Go Pokemon World. Pokemon Let's Go World. And I mean, we have child in each region. From the Kanto region all the way to the Alola. No, 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 no. To Galar. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Kanto to Galar. That means eight generations rolled into one. Mm. That means we gotta kill. We gotta sell at one region to travel to the others. If I was to choose... A region, I would have two choices on mine. I would choose the Unova region or the Alola region. I'm not going to lie. It says a freaking word. If you ask me again, flip my fucking birds. <laughs> so, if y'all like this video, please, like I said, leave a comment below. It's, it's, it drives me crazy how I know what's going to happen next. But when it comes to Pokemon, people, if your battle skills are fast as lightning, well, your boy, Chris Blackthorne Harris, could be like the almighty dog of Johto, Raikou, and bring out the thunder. 
I'm just saying. 